So Hulu has just opened up their applications for all of you binge watchers out there to get paid to report on your TV watching experience. Now, this is a high paying job and it comes with a ton of perks, including a brand new laptop and office setup stipend. So you can be super comfortable working in your PJs. And I do have several other bonus opportunities. So watch to the end to see which one of these roles is the perfect fit for you. But super duper quick, you know, I got to do shout outs because you guys have been getting some awesome jobs. I have been missing some of these comments that you all have been putting um, on the channel. So I do apologize. But Miss Leah said, Jazzy, I got the job. It's the job of my uh, dreams from a private listing for a remote job at a tax firm. I used your templates and watched your live stream and you lit me on fire. Thank you for all that you do. And I feel so blessed. You made the process so much easier. And Leah also mentioned that she started on December 5th and yes, she got a huge pay raise and she said, I want to thank you and share that your system works. I am so grateful for your help and support. Well, Leah, I am so proud of you. I'd love to know what the company is and just how your experience has been so far, but I am very, very excited for you and I hope you've been enjoying it for the last month or so. And then Miss Nicole said, Jazzy, I finally did it. I got hired at Rent the Runway. My start date is February 12th. I used your resume templates and interview tips. Thank you for creating this system and your words of encouragement for anyone struggling. Don't give up. It may take a while, but it will eventually happen. Just keep applying no matter what. Never underestimate the power of a follow-up email. Thanking them for the interview. OMG, Nicole, number one, I'm proud of you. Number two, too, even more proud of you that you sent a follow-up email, um, a thank you note email. A lot of people don't do that. And that is just a very old school way of making yourself memorable and increasing your chances of getting the job. So congratulations to you, Nicole. And then we have Miss Regina that said, hi, Jazzy. I wanted to let you know that I was hired today with JP Morgan Chase using your job template. I am so excited for you. Chase is an awesome company to work for. Uh, they have some of the best training around. And of course, they provide you with the equipment. And I am just like, I'm really excited that you're starting with a a fintech company like JP uh, Morgan. So congratulations to you, Regina. We're very excited for you. And then Miss Sarah said, Hey, Jazzy, first off, thanks for you all that you do. The amount of energy that you put into us has not gone unnoticed. May you continue the good fight. Next, I got the Delta Elite position and my start date was December 4th. I'm excited. The pay is less than I am used to, but I don't plan on staying entry level for long. I'm super excited and overjoyed that I get to work from home. Thanks again. You rock. Moving on up. I love it. I love it. I love it. First of all, I love that you're thinking long term because even if you have to take a pay cut, to get that um, airline experience, to get that software as a service experience, to get that fintech experience. It is so worth it because honestly, you could work for Delta Airlines for six months and get that travel and that hospitality experience and jump right on over to American Express and be making six figures for pretty much the same exact role. So I love that you're thinking long term. Congratulations to you. I hope you enjoy working for Delta and girls, save me a buddy pass because I like to travel. Okay. And then Miss Casilla said, I applied and got the job at TurboTax. The, uh, the pay offer was $20 an hour plus a bonus at the end. Thank you for all your help. Congratulations to you. Very excited for you. TurboTax is going to be a very fun company because there's a lot of just energetic people that work at TurboTax. So congratulations to you. And then Miss Princess said, Hey, Jazzy, I just wanted to let you know that I got the job at Yelp as an inside sales rep. Your resume kit helped me out. My start date is January 8th. Thank you for all your work and tips. And I just wanted to mention to you all that Yelp has like six figure roles. Um, so when you start out as like an inside sales rep, I think it's like maybe 60,000 or 70,000 a year, um, with all the bonuses that you get, but the next job above that, like an account manager, you're easily going to go into making six figures. So I'm very proud of you. Very excited. So let's look at this very first bonus opportunity that we have out here. So our first bonus opportunity is going to be for Motorola. You all have had that Motorola flip phone, that Razor. 
So you're very familiar with the company. What's cool is they've got some part-time positions as well as uh, full-time positions working in loss prevention. So these are the same exact roles that we're going to cover. One is just part-time, one is full-time. And it says here at um, Motorola, it says, Envision, a Motorola solutions company, is a provider of enterprise video security, okay? So basically, it's an AI-powered video security and access control that they use to eliminate or help reduce the amount of fraud that happens at restaurants and retail locations, right? Um, without you having to monitor hours of video footage. So we've got AI doing most of the work for us in this particular position. So this could, this is just an example, but it could be a situation where there is a camera that is facing down on either a cash register, or maybe it's facing down on the display at the Motorola store or the T-Mobile store. And, you know, the AI picks up that it was supposed to be three cell phones on the display rack. And now there's only one and it, and it alerts you to say, Hey, it looks like there was some theft happening. And so you just review that little 10 seconds of footage and you make a report about it if you feel like it actually was some theft that happened. So it's saying you're going to review the customer data and the video using that software to identify theft, lost, or egregious operational issues. And you're going to document that in a report easy peasy lemon squeezy you're not talking on phones to anyone and again this is a remote position for anyone in the united states they do have the full-time position um, if you want to do full time as well. Now the resumes are already done for you. Those are already in your portal. So if you wanted to apply for that job, you can do that. The pay for this job is down here. It's, they've got incentive bonus plans as well. So you're going to get a base salary plus additional salary on top of it. Um, and they do have like pay parental and family leave. So, um, the hourly rate is $19 and 25 cents an hour plus whatever bonuses you get on top of that. So very entry level friendly. In fact, it actually says it in here. It says it somewhere in this job description that this is an entry level position. So perfect for those of you that are just getting back out there, but you want to do something at home with your kids, um, you know, without having to have a bunch of experience. So this is a great position that could lead you into a job working for a tech company, banking company, compliance, audit, even cybersecurity, um, because of the technology that they're going to train you to use. Okay. So again, you don't have to have a whole bunch of experience for this. Um, and there's no college experience or anything like that. Um, they just want you to be able to look at software and build reports and that sort of thing. Okay. A uh, high school diploma is all you need for this position. Now, the next position that we're going to take a look at, this is our bonus opportunity. Number two, this is the Maven Clinic. If you've never heard of the Maven Clinic, they are all about making, um, infer making fertility possible for women and also for families that are just in general trying to expand their family. Their family. So they offer maternal support. Uh, they also offer support for other things like menopause and how to, you know, get into the, the world of parenthood and things of that nature. So with this company, they are uh, featuring a member services associate position. Now with this member services associate position, it says you're going to respond to tier one and tier two inquiries related to payment products or the facility fertility managed services benefits. So someone may send in an email or a ticket that says, Hey, I am thinking about undergoing fertility treatments through my employer. You know, what does that look like? And then you'd say, Hey, we check your benefits and see how that works out. 
But again, this is through messaging and live chats, okay? And there could be some occasional phone conversations that you may have to conduct. But my guess is that you are primarily going to be doing this through messaging and live chat, but make sure you ask the recruiter. Now for this position, they do train you. They do provide the equipment to you. As long as you've got a little bit of customer support experience, that is pretty much all the experience you need. Or if you've ever worked in claims or collections, um, that's going to be a plus for you. And if you speak Spanish, that is also a plus as well. As far as the pay goes, um, they don't list it out, but from what I researched, the pay is 20 to $25 per hour, depending on if you come in as an associate or as a senior member services associate. So a bunch of you probably have the experience to be brought in as a senior, but that's the only difference in these two positions. I do want to point out that they offer 16 weeks of paid parental leave. And they also, while you're on leave, you get full payment of your salary during those uh, 16 weeks. And then they give you an additional $1,500 a month for the first two months for what they call a new parent stipend. So this goes for male and females. Um, you don't have to be the birth parent if you adopted a child um, or if you are the father in this situation, the parental leave applies to mothers, fa fathers alike. So there's no, you know, restrictions on that. So they've got all these other incredible benefits as well. But again, the resumes are already in your portal. So don't let this opportunity pass you by. Now, in addition to our Hulu opportunity, which we're about to take a look at, I wanted to give you one more bonus opportunity for those of you that have worked in human resources. I've had a bunch of people that have worked in talent acquisition where you specialize in bringing in, you know, talent. Um, and doing the recruiting process, the assessments process, setting up interviews, doing that screening, um, setting up panels, things of that nature. So a lot of you have worked in HR and you're looking for a much higher paying HR job. So in this one, this is going to be targeted towards um, people that either work across marketing or people that work in what is considered um, enterprise leadership roles, okay? So if you've never worked in enterprise leadership or if you don't have marketing experience, but you have general HR experience, you should be applying for this. If you have any talent acquisition experience, or if you, I don't care if you work at a restaurant and you were just responsible for interviewing people, you know, doing hiring and onboarding, you need to be applying for this job like ASAP. Because of the pay alone, you're going to make $151,000 minimum up to $213,000. Like this is an amazing salary for those of you that already work in recruiting. You're probably not making quite this much, but you're probably doing this same exact job. So if you've got that HR experience, Again, apply for this like ASAP. The uh, Disney positions typically close pretty quickly. So you may want to jump on this like ASAP. Now, the moment that we've all been waiting for, I've been getting a lot of like requests for um, positions like this next one. So let's just hop on in. This position, again, fully remote before anybody asks this question, but in this position, you're basically going to be looking at the experience of the people that are tuning into Disney Plus and Hulu, ESPN, ESPN Plus. And the whole goal of this team is going to be um, what they call the playback quality optimization team. So they're managing the media experience of the customers, right? That are on Disney and Hulu. And it's basically all about meeting um, the customer needs and analyzing the experience that customers are having. So this is, this could be related to when people are watching Hulu, um, their use of subtitles. Are the subtitles appearing on the screen 
properly. You know, maybe there is um, some sort of accessibility options on the screen and our customers um, having a good experience with that is the volume on these TV shows and movies and appropriate volume or, you know, does the sound just does it sound super weird when you're watching certain things and it's super loud in some scenes and super quiet in other scenes? So it says um, here that they basically, it says the products are embedded into the video players and they oversee the media playback, making the quality of experience decisions in real time, influencing what users see and hear. Okay. So this team is assessing the customer needs and, to, and basically refining um, those playback experiences for the customers. So the streaming of video and looking at how clearly the video is being played, the sound, the audio, um, again, the subtitles, all of that stuff is pretty much what they're looking for. So this is great for all of my techies out there, the people that have either worked in, in some sort of audio, video, filming, if you've worked in, uh, you've got any coding experience, this is going to be great for you because they do use technologies like Rust, TypeScript, TypeScript and Python. For me, Python was like the easiest coding um, language to learn. So I learned Python in like a few days, like, it, you know, the basics of Python and that stuff. So a lot of you probably have other coding languages that you know, but their basic qualifications are five years experience in software development, uh, proficiency in Rust, and having a track record of owning and delivering projects and being able to support a 24 seven system. Most of you have worked in either production support or QA testing, all of that stuff. So again, this is for my high level techies that um, are really like just super good at getting into the weeds of, you know, troubleshooting. If something's not displaying correctly, again, you film people that have worked in audio visual, um, that sort of stuff, you should be applying for this ASAP. I don't care if you've never worked at a tech company. If you have audio visual AV training, you should be applying for this because Many times these companies, even if you don't have a lot of coding experience, they will pay for your training. They will either pay for you to go to a boot camp or pay for you to get a certification. Or a lot of the times they offer you on the job training where they're like, okay, maybe we won't let you do the coding until you get more experience, but we'll let you do something else around this. You know, we can use that AV experience um, for you to review. I don't know, like the logs, the, you know, issues or bugs that are being reported by customers, things of that nature. So again, you are getting paid to talk about the video playback and the experience that customers are having when they watch Hulu, right? This is a super duper high paying job. 142,000 is the minimum uh, for this job, depending on what state you're in. And it goes up to almost 200K. So again, very, very high paying. Yes, the resumes are done for you, but this is just, it's an amazing company to work for, you know, like who wouldn't want to get paid to talk about Hulu and the viewing experience when they're watching ESPN and when they're watching Disney Plus. And yes, all of those companies are under the Disney tech umbrella and they all kind of, you know, are just, like I said, under the same umbrella. So this would pretty much open you up to a ton, a ton of opportunities if you just get your foot in the door. So again, the resumes are already done for you. Congratulations to everyone that's gotten jobs already. Jazzy's so freaking proud of you guys. And make sure that you go back and look at the previous videos around interviewing because those videos have been super helpful for people, not just getting jobs, but also getting offered more in their salary. Because as we always say, if you stay ready, you never ever have to get ready.